Hi there, I am Husky Light. Welcome to my channel. Thank you so, so much, first of all, for your likes, your shares, your subscribes, um, all, all my new subscribers, subscribers that have always been with me. Um, I love you all and I so, so appreciate um, the fact that you're with me. So thank you. Right, uh, Gemini, your weekly reading, um, and I am going from Monday, um, the 10th of August through to Sunday, the 16th of August. So here we go, hope you enjoy. The first card I've got for you is the Three of Pentacles. This is in your health and your spiritual section. Um, your health is probably likely to be showing a really good increase this week. It's not the result of a miracle though, um, although we would like it to be. I think for most of you, it's the result of the work that you've already been doing to improve on your health. And this card is showing you that you're on the right track and to keep doing what you're doing and keep on that that health regime, whatever that may be. Uh, for those of you who haven't started that health regime yet or who have, haven't started to try and improve their health, this week is the week to do it. Spiritually, um, it may be that you're looking into or may do well to look into organizations and traditional and traditions that could give you some very wonderful and deep insights right now into spiritual things. Um, you don't have to actually go and join an organization unless you wish to, um, but some of these insights can be got simply by reading about different belief systems, um, different organizations, learning more about rituals from the past. Um, they're gonna deepen, if you start to learn about things like this, I think um, it will deepen your spiritual understanding and your practice and lead you to, to new fantastic insights as well this week. Um, okay, our next card is the Eight of Wands in reverse. I was trying to figure out which way to put the card so it looks in reverse to you. Um, Eight of Wands in reverse and this is down to your career and your money section for some of you not all of you this is a general reading for gemini's there may be some disagreements and arguments at work this week when this card appears um you or the people that you work with have put too much effort into things to to, to let these little issues get to you and become major issues so if this is happening this week you need to back off you need to cool down you need to rethink things um, if you are not working and you've been looking for for work I think unfortunately this week there may be some delays it may be a decision that you're waiting for um, just trust on the outcome trust that things will work out okay and work out the way that they should and they probably will but there may be some delays if you're waiting on an answer about a job this week Financially, um, just the same as with the upright, right meaning really, um, you need to have some patience and maybe some long-term thinking with regards to finances and money. Uh, Rome wasn't built in a day, neither, <laughs> neither is your long-term financial security. It's something that has to go slowly and is built up slowly. Take a deep breath and just hang on in there with whatever your financial situation is this week it will improve but it's going to be um a slow process for you um friends and family position we have got the hanged man um in the in the upright position i think for some of you with friends and family there is some sort of crossroads that you have come to it may be literally that you are waiting on a decision from somebody else within the family um in regards to something and you've literally been hanging around for those of you who are waiting or wanting to make a decision it's a very clear-cut thing either yes or no um and it may be some of you are wanting to do something about a certain situation in a family or friend situation but you not have no idea what it is that you need to do to fix it um if you don't know what you do need to do to fix the situation you need to stop this week relax 
maybe not make any sort of decision this week and look at different ways in in which you might need to um, let go of a certain situation, people, um, friendship within your friends and family. Just just look at different ways of of doing that. It could be that you've got some. You need to let go of some sort of um, outmoded belief that you've got within a family or friends situation. Maybe things in a in a family or friends situation don't work any longer with the belief that you've got, and that needs to be changed. It needs to be updated. It needs to be more flexible than it has in the past. Um, your attitudes need to change a little bit and you need to be a bit more bendy in some things if you can actually do this then then things will open up um, and bring more positive into whatever this situation is within friends and family you just need to be thoughtful I think you need to think about things a little bit this week um, look at different things of do ways of doing things get rid of these outmoded beliefs it might be that you are just sticking to your guns on something and it needs to be changed in order to bring about more harmony within whatever this is going on this week within your friends and family. Be willing to change, be willing to be more flexible, be um, willing to discuss possibilities and options this week in order to bring um, some sort of resolution to whatever this is going on um, in your friends and family or friends or family this week whatever that situation is and your last card is um, the ten of cups in reverse and this is for your love situations this week um, so if you're already in a romantic relationship um, it could be that you're spending far too much time questioning what's going on in it dreaming about um, maybe even dreaming about the one that got away and not your present partner um, so pay attention to the here and now pay attention to what is going on in your relationship and the person in your relationship now you cannot make um, stop making this dream partner in your head um, and don't try and ruin a, a decent, a perfectly decent relationship by doing that, by, by dreaming of what could have been or what should have been or the one that got away, like I say, be thankful for the one that you've got. Yeah, it, unless you're in a relationship where you've got absolutely no feelings whatsoever for your current partner, then it's it's time to to make a decision this week and move away from that situation um but if you are in a long-term relationship and you do have feelings for that partner then make the effort to carry that forward and make things more concrete between you and try and smooth out any bumps that you've got with them this week instead of looking back on the past if you're not in a relationship and you're looking for one um this card reminds us that everybody is individual um, do not put impossibly high standards on potential new partners that may come into your life this week if anybody does um, everybody is individual and you have to respect and accept everybody as an individual for their own thoughts their own ideals um, and they all can't be the same as yours and accept them and be grateful for their differences if you meet somebody new this week and if you can do that, then things will absolutely go fine. Okay, that is your reading for this week, Gemini. I hope you enjoyed it. If you'd like a private reading, um, please click on the link above. Um, and I will get that booked in for you, no problem. If you've got any specific questions that you can't find the answers to, or you are having difficulties with, I can help you with that. And we can get some clarity on the situation. Okay, take care. I love you loads. And I will speak to you soon. Bye.